Hey guys, so now I wanted to show you, I am at actually two points in this project. Uh, one is I have come to an area in my yarn. I'm gonna try and show you up close here where there's a knot. So it looks like when this yarn was made, um, it came to the end of this strand and they just tied on a new one. Now that is gonna mess you up. If you see an actual knot, like that came from the manufacturer, you're gonna have to uh, cut it because, let me lay this back down. As you can see, they tied in a new color and it was purple, but that doesn't work with it this this part's too short and it just doesn't work with the color flow so um seeing that i only have this much left i'm gonna i'm gonna cut this and then i'm just gonna um add in my new my new skein of yarn uh if you had more yarn than this left in your skein you can uh rejoin you can find another point in the yarn to rejoin. That makes sense. But let me just show you what I'm gonna do here. So I'm going to clip this off right here at my pink. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna throw this part away. There wasn't much left. Okay, so now I need to add in the new yarn. And you can't just you can't just go ahead and add in any old color. You have to find your color pattern. So I'm gonna wanna join in my pink. And then after the pink, I believe is the dark pink. So let's see, let's just see what we have. So I had pink, dark pink, purple, the blue, the light purple, the pink, okay. So, let's see here. I'm gonna have to unravel till I get to the pink. Okay, there's my pink. So, okay, here we go. So it went purple, the light purple, the pink, and then after the pink, we should have, yep, the dark pink. So there's my color pattern. Okay, so I'm gonna disregard the purple and the blue because I have blue, I have purple. Then I have my pink. I've already done one, two, three, four, five of these. So really I only need enough pink. You're gonna have to guesstimate here and you can always unravel if needed. I'm going to just add in enough pink to do one more little cluster and then I'm gonna start, then it should go right into the dark pink. Okay, so I'm gonna come over here and I am going to, I'm actually going to just go back one little step so I can add in, let's get my hook here, just so I can add this in. Let's see, let's add it in about here. Okay. Crochet one more little cluster. Eh. And look, I've already I've already grabbed the wrong side of the yarn. Okay, here we go. This is the side that you're gonna weave in. You're gonna just clip this off a little bit and weave that in. All right. One, two, three. Mm. I feel like I mismeasured just a teensy bit. I'm gonna go back, pull this a little. Okay, let's try that one more time. One, two, three. Then I'm basically right here at my dark pink. put this down so I can show you. Okay, so now I've added in the new yarn. I finished off the pink. I am now on the dark pink, which makes sense. See how this row is staggered and it lines up. And I'm just going to cut this. 
Uh, just want to make sure I'm cutting the right part here. Yep. Cut that off. You're going to discard this part of it and you'll just weave this in at the end. 